Hey everyone, it's Emilio here, and I'm going to show you really quickly how to connect Yak and MailChimp together so that you can easily create campaign drafts as soon as you think of them and send a voice message over and automatically create it as a draft inside of MailChimp. So, first things first, we're going to want to go to yak.com forward slash integrations forward slash Zapier. And we're going to scroll down all the way just below the template section into the tutorial section, and we'll see how to connect Yak to MailChimp. Click View Tutorial, and in here we're going to click the link that says connect Yak to MailChimp. This will lead us straight to the template. We're going to click try this template and it will immediately send us to the Zapier workflow. So let's click get started. First things first from here we're going to select our Yak account. If you don't see it on the list all you have to do is click the connect a new account button, sign in using the browser and once it's added to the list select it and click next. In this step we're going to tell Zapier which discussions or one-to-one -one messages to look at to pull information from and send over and create a draft inside of MailChimp. Let's use our test discussion. Now in this step, it's going to ask us to connect our MailChimp account. All we have to do is click connect, use the browser to sign in, and once it's there, select it from the list and click next. Alright, now that I've connected my own, let's click next. That's going to give you a list of a couple things you can uncheck or check to make sure that you've customized the fields exactly how you want it to for when Yak sends over the information and creates a draft of a campaign inside of MailChimp. So we can scroll over these to make sure that everything we want is selected. I'm going to select campaign name just for myself and click next. Now for the campaign name, I'm going to select the message subject as I'm going to make sure every time I send a message to include a subject so that way it names the campaign inside the draft. And as far as audience, we're going to select it from the list and click next. Now we can send a test. And once you have verified that the draft campaign has been sent over, all we have to do is click next and on this step, turn on the zap and we're well on our way to easily creating new campaign drafts into MailChimp just by sending over a Yak message.